spike chain slash flippy chains, acupuncture rings, Orby Gorilla stress balls, monkey noodles, poppets, mochis, pea poppers, fidget pads, and fidget pads. The 10 best fidget toys. If you get built up aggression or tension in your hands, these are perfect to squeeze. I love that they're super simple and don't have any extra parts. Poppers are so big right now. I have three shapes and four color choices. They have a loud side and a quiet side. They have so many uses. The acupressure rings are super cheap and they have a really unique feel to them. Sometimes the seam where they're put together pops apart, but it's okay, don't throw them away. Pull it apart little by little, it's so satisfying. Mesh and marble are my top recommendation because they're quiet so you can use them anywhere and they'll last you for years. Tangles are a big hit. I have shiny ones and textured ones. Wacky tracks are kind of similar but also very different. Super durable also. Okay, I only got to five. I'm going to have to do a part two. So my first order is for Elliot and he ordered an Aki pressure ring. So this is the lolly I'm going to give him. Now let's pack it. All done. Thanks, Elliot. So my next order is for Rihanna and she asked me to pack hers on TikTok. So obviously I'm going to do that. So she ordered one acupressure ring. So I've got out my lolly. So now let's pack it. All done. Thank you, Rihanna. So this order is for Amy and she ordered an acupressure ring. I'm giving her a Coca-Cola lolly. So let's pack it. All done. So this order is for Tia and they've ordered four acupressure rings. So I'm giving them this lolly and now I'm going to pack it. All done. So this order is for Zoe. So I've got out a lolly and acupressure rings. Now let's pack it. Thank you, Zoe. You wanted a purple themed pack? You got it. Shaggy Nido. Purple Monkey Noodle. This looks blue, but it's purple. And we have our purple slime egg. Let's start packing. Put this in here. We're gonna try to squeeze this in here. There we go. And of course, an X. Put the top on. I hope your order comes soon. Okay guys, let's pack another order with me. First thing this person wanted was a tangle, so let's just put in this tangle. Next thing they wanted was mochis, and I usually include these for extras, but this time someone ordered them. The first mochi I'll put in is gonna be the starfish one because it's super cute and adorable. I'll also add a panda mochi because they're super cute and really fun to squish. And lastly, I think I'll do the bunny mochi. Next thing she ordered was a simple dimple, so let's put this in. And the final thing was some monkey noodles, so I think we'll do four of them. Let's start packing it. Now finally, you can't forget about the extras, so for the extras, I'll include a bike chain and two porcupine balls. Bye, thank you for her envelope. She ordered a rainbow square poppet, a sponge and squish bear, a pink jaw ball, a green textured orb ball, a blue needle, got out the business card, and the sherbet. So let's pack it. All packaged up, thanks Jasmine. This order's for Amy Clark. She ordered a green needle, and a red textured orb ball. Got out the business card and a sherbet. So let's pack it. Thanks, Amy. This order's for Alice. She ordered a blue emoji man and a sponge and squish bear. Got out the business card and a sherbet. So let's pack it. Thanks, Alice. Random questions people have been asking me. How long does shipping take? Shipping normally takes a couple weeks, but if you live outside of United States or Canada, it will take around three weeks. Do we ship internationally? Yes, we ship all over the world. How much money is shipping? Shipping is around $6, but it depends where you live. Is our stuff good quality or bad quality? Yes, we do our research a lot and buying a lot of products trial and error to see which ones are good and which ones break easy. So yes, I assure you that they won't break easily.
she ordered a dimple, a crab, monkey noodles, a marble mesh, a pea pod, and a zippy bracelet. I've put them all in a packet and I've got out my lolly. So let's pack it. All done. Poppets are in stock. I've got crab poppets, dimples, pea pods, marble and meshes, acupressure balls, monkey noodles, acupressure rings, fidget pens, zippy bracelets. They're quite hard to zip with one hand. And that's it for now, but I've got loads more stock on the way, so I'll just keep you updated. Thank you. Bye. Comment questions in the comments. I have my own business check. This is my most popular product. This is my favorite product. This is one of my most expensive products. This is my most affordable product. <laughs> yes, I know they're just fooies. This is also one of my favorite products. These are my newest products. Also a new product. Mesh and marble. Zipper bracelets. Bike chains slash fit floppy chains. Acupuncture rings. Orby gorilla stress balls. Monkey noodles. Poppets. Mochis. Pea poppers. And fidget pads. And fidget pads. The 10 best fidget toys. If you get built up aggression or tension in your hands, these are perfect to squeeze. I love that they're super simple and don't have any extra parts. Poppers are so big right now. I have three shapes and four color choices. They have a loud side and a quiet side. They have so many uses. The acupressure rings are super cheap and they have a really unique feel to them. Sometimes the seam where they're put together pops apart, but it's okay, don't throw them away. Pull it apart little by little, it's so satisfying. Mesh and Marble are my top recommendation because they're quiet so you can use them anywhere and they'll last you for years. Tangles are a big hit. I have shiny ones and textured ones. Wacky tracks are kind of similar but also very different. Super durable also. Okay, I only got the five. And I was like, OMG, that's going to be so cute. Because look at this bracelet. It's literally pink and blue. I actually have so many options in those colors. I had to do eeny, meeny, miny, mo to decide which snake to pick. She bought one of my brand new color changing balls. Look how cute my new logo sticker looks on it. For the bicycle chain, I picked a blue and yellow one because I don't have any blue and pink. Okay, listen, my manufacturer just sent me bigger size rings. So I gave her one of each and I hope she does a review of which one she prefers. I gave her a pink dough ball and then I realized she actually ordered two bicycle chains. So I picked a blue and green one for her second. I felt like it needed more pink, so I added a free sticky hand to her order. Then I printed the shipping label, sealed it up, and put it with its package friends to ship out on